Hey, hello, this is Anup here, and in this video, we are going to see SCM primary server upgrade from 1910 version to 2002. Right? That is the latest version of SCM production, or it's called MECM or configuration manager, right? Let's let's have a look into it, right? You just need to go to updates and servicing and check for new updates right if you are opt into the latest version of 2002 this is a fast string at the moment and it they will release it to all the sscm infrastructures around the world once it's generally available right at the moment if you want to get 2002 version of sscm then you need to run a powershell command right i will provide the details of the powershell command in the description of this video okay as you have seen in the previous screens of the video uh, you just need to go through the normal configuration manager updates wizard and configure the requirement components and close the wizard right you just need to close it and continue monitoring the the installation progress right so you can do status show status and you can go to monitoring uh, workspace in sscm console and check for the updates or you can use the log files as you can see it is going to the replication okay after that the prerequisite checks will run then installation i'll pause the video and come back okay so there is a warning in prerequisite check i think that can be ignored because that is for uh backlog right that should be fine you can you can check the log files to get more details and the installation in progress now you can see extracting the update packages now okay so what i can see over here <laughs> okay i got a message error message that is sms provider error so I need to kind of look into it, what is happening, right? So I try to connect, launch the console and connect to my primary server and it's not working, right? So normally what I do is restart the device right i have restarted the device and it worked for me uh, so in between i post the video that is why you didn't see that but i just restarted the uh, the server primary server and i'm just going back to look at the installation right it's still go extract update package step is still going on but the installation is automatically progressing from where it stopped right so even if you restart the server you don't need to worry much if you restart the server in between the upgrade process uh, you don't need to worry much as per my experience but i would recommend uh, you to you trying this in pre-production before you do it in production environment right okay but this is what my experience is so i think that should be fine with you as well if you face any kind of issues um, like this during the upgrade process right so let's pause the video and come back uh, once we have completed the upgrade right so it is going to the installation phase until now and it's probably it will start the install services step in few minutes or so 
so the installation phase got completed um, and the post installation phase started so i'm going to pause the video again and come back so post installation phase is almost completed now now it's installing the sc sms replication configuration manager so the post installation is also completed now since the post installation also completed so we are successfully done with the upgrade of the infrastructure uh, to SCM or configuration manager 2002 now we need to upgrade the console right that is the last process of the upgrade process um, or update process right so it's giving me an option to upgrade the console i clicked ok on that now it will install the latest SCM or MECM console on my primary server that process is going on i'll pause the video and come back so after the installation or update of SCM console the console will get automatically launched and you can check the version numbers of the console over here right from the about configuration manager option so this is the latest version of the console 2002 version and uh, you have successfully upgraded or updated the SCM infrastructure to the latest version as you can see over here okay Thank you for watching. Hope this video was useful. Bye-bye.